you ever just stop and think I mean, I'm sure right now especially everybody's doing a lot of thinking but I feel like I've done this all my life <clears throat> I've uh, I started I started Splashinator games I think um when was that I started way before that um I think it's been since like 20 I want to say 2010 maybe even 2011 that I really started to enjoy this whole video thing just making videos it doesn't it doesn't matter like what kind of video it was I just enjoyed making videos and obviously I enjoyed making the ones that um, have a lot of passion put into them you know like like Z and me you know and I've had a lot of people tell me you know the channel is not getting any views or it's not getting many subscribers um, honestly like a channel like Splash Squad was lucky to have it was lucky like I was happy to have like 45 subscribers on Splash Squad. I thought I couldn't ever overturn Splash and Air Games, which I think has 60 subscribers. Um, and Splash Squad Entertainment currently has 381 subscribers at the filming of this video. But what people don't realize is I never cared about that. You know, I, I've always cared about the memories I made along the way and I've always just really enjoyed filming I mean uh, as, as early back as if any of you remember the uh, cameras that have the cassette tapes in them <laughs> or just tapes I think it was I think it was just tape um, and it would just roll and it would uh, capture the film uh, me and Gavin, or me and Critter, um, we filmed uh, a video, I think it was called what Michael and Gavin do every day or something like that, and it was, and I lost it, and I was so sad that I lost it, uh, maybe one day I'll find it, but it's just a tape that has that on it, if I ever find it I'll post it, or I'm, I'll look at it, but the point is like I've I've always enjoyed doing this and this is not work to me you know um, I've always wanted this to be a job um, I don't I don't believe it can't be um, I believe that one day it could possibly be a job um, and I wholeheartedly believe in this channel. I honestly do. Um, I think this is my birthday video, by the way. It's uh, December nineteenth. This, this is I'm nineteen today. Um, this is an unedited video. I just decided to do it because I felt like talking, you know, and ranting, but um, I think my biggest fear is that this, that I'll have to leave this channel behind, um, but I, I'm never going to leave 
my passion behind. I will never give up. Um, and that's the name of this video, probably. <laughs> I will never give up. I will never give up on my dream to become a cinematographer or an actor or anything in the entertainment division, you know. Um, it's just something I really enjoy doing. I love, like, I don't care if I don't have an audience at all. If I do, I'm very happy to see everybody's, you know, reaction to what I what what we have done. Um, yes, I've I've done most of the work. <laughs> Again, it's not work to me, but I've done most of the work in terms of making these videos and making these movies and series and stories. Um, and obviously, uh, Gavin and, uh, JT have helped as well, and Nick, um, and even my parent, you know, my mom, uh, my mom's helped me with the channel, uh, dad, dad's helped me with this, um, everybody in my life, everybody in my life has helped me, like, helped me to figure out what I'm doing, you know, like, cause, I don't know, it's just, uh, I'm ranting, but, I'm 19 years old now, and I realized that all this time, I've been working for this, for this, and, you may call me crazy, but I don't think it was a waste of time. Um, I'm not saying, by the way, this video, I'm not saying that I'm closing off Splash Squad yet. Um, but I'm saying that it could very well happen in the future because I can't really have a Splash Squad without the squad, you know? Um, but, um, yeah, the point of the, this channel was to be, uh, was to bring my friends and family together to make a, um, to make memories. And that was the whole point of the channel. And I want, and yes, I've tried to get views on this channel. I mean, like the antiseptic eye stuff and the, and the the reviews and the um, trying to follow like TikTok trends and stuff. Yes, I've tried to get views on this channel, but that's only because I wanted it to last longer. Because if I started making money off of this channel, then I would be able to pay uh, the squad, <laughs> and we could make a living off of it. But since it doesn't seem like that's going to happen, um. I'm just saying that the, the channel won't last forever. Uh, and I'm saying that now. I will not give up on this channel. Now, um, yes, there will probably be a time where this channel completely stops its uploads. You know, it completely stops everything. Um, and that's okay, and I'm okay with that. But... I will never give up on it. And what I mean by that is I will always try to make something out of this, you know? But me doing this has taught me so much, so much in the field that I wanted to. And I just, you know, for the two people that are watching, um, I thank you all for just helping me along the way because you may not realize it but every comment every like every view um and basically every video that I've made you know it's made me feel better you know I'm a creator there are people that uh like to watch and listen to things to help them 
uh, in whatever bad times they are or to make them feel better during their day or to, you know, make them laugh or cry or, you know, whatever they're looking for at that time because, you know, people seek um, ways to escape. Uh, and that's what entertainment has been for me. It's been my escape. It's been... I obviously enjoy entertaining, um, but entertainment, this channel has helped me in so many ways. Like, I'm able to just, you know, <laughs> just put it out there, you know, get it out of my system. You know, it's like whenever I write raps, you know, whenever I write songs and stuff, um, I'm a creator. That's how I get it out of me, you know, like I have to bring something out of me I gotta keep myself doing something you know I gotta keep myself I gotta keep myself entertained to entertain if that makes any sense um, because I enjoy doing it so much that it it gives me um, a reason to just just live I mean, I'm not saying that I'm, you know, suicidal or anything. I'm just saying, like, it gives me a reason. It gives me um, something to care about, you know? I mean, yeah, obviously I care about my family and I care about my friends and close friends, you know? But this is something else. This is a different love. This is a, this is a passion. And, um... I realize, and the point of this video, uh, there is really no point, but the point of me ranting and everything is that um, I realize that I'm getting older. I realize that my friends and family and everybody is getting older around me, and I need to accept the truth, you know? Um, and the truth is... I'm not going to give up. And I will never give up on what I love to do. And um, I will never give up on anything that I love. Or anyone. I will never give up on anyone I love. Because, you know... We've all been through some hard times. And people around me have been through hard times. And I've seen the impossible happen to people. And I've seen the impossible happen on this channel. You know, I never thought we would get 100 subscribers. That's why I have a flipping rock with... Me and Gavin's name signed on it. Yeah, JT, you still need to sign it. <laughs> Nick, you do too. Um, but trust me whenever I say that I will never give up because a lot of people say that they won't ever give up, but they do. No one... No one that's given up has ever succeeded, at least in what they gave up on. Um, and I'm sorry, but I can't name a single person that has never given up on trying that has failed. <laughs> because the impossible is possible. I believe that anything is possible. And that's why I believe that I can do great things. And I believe that my family and my friends, my sisters, my just close relatives, everybody, I believe that we all have a potential to do so great um, you know you could be at the bottom of the ladder 
and I believe I have been and I at least know a lot of people that have been but they've climbed the ladder you know they've climbed the ladder they may have fell a couple of times while they were climbing it but they climbed the ladder and they may still not be at the top because you'll never be at the top but you'll be pretty high on the ladder to the point where you don't have to taste success because you have it I'm not an inspirational speaker I'm not I'm honestly not even trying to help anybody right now but if this helps you then great but this is just me putting my feelings out there and I'm tired of hiding who I am behind a facade um so if there's any moment that I need to be real this is where I'm gonna go <sighs> uh, sorry it's just really hard for me to do this uh, but <sighs> I think I should just end it on I'm never going to give up on this channel, on my dreams, on my on my family, on everything. I'm never going to give up. I'm never going to give up. And I think I'm ready. I'm re I'm ready I'm ready for life. And what I mean by that is I'm I'm ready to <laughs> I'm I'm ready to start believing that things are possible. Well, go watch another video that's not so, um, I guess, uh, serious. <laughs> if you made it this far, Lord, what the heck are you doing here? <laughs> Subscribe, I guess, if you want. Um, we'll be here. We'll be uploading. Uh, I got plenty of more ideas. We still got to finish the enemy. Uh, and believe me, that will get finished. Um, Yeah. Keep on splashing. <laughs>